Hey everybody, it's me, William Schmid. And, uh, it's been a while since I posted my last video, so here I am to do another edition of Flix Files. Actually here to review the Penguins of Madagascar movie. So it came out from DreamWorks Animation and 20th Century Box. Pretty much a uh, Puss in Boots style spin-off to Madagascar. Where instead of Puss in Boots being it, it's the uh, Madagascar Penguins. <laughs> I know. Well, anyway, it actually starts off with sort of an origin, origin story, with uh, Skipper, Rico, and Kowalski as little baby baby penguins in Antarctica, where they end up saving an egg from being eaten by liver seals, and it turns out the egg hatches and eventually becomes private. Private. Ten years, and the ten years later, after that, seeing the events of Madagascar three. They escape the circus to celebrate, celebrate Private's 10th birthday by breaking into Port Knox to get Knox to not steal gold, but to try and get some uh, snack. Some uh, cheese doodle kind of snack called Cheesy Devils. Noodles <gasps> that were discontinued. Apparently they were then abducted, bu abducted by uh, abducted by the machine alien. Uh, and it turned out it was actually a ruse created by Day. Dave the Octopus, this, who was uh, under his uh, human disguise form, Dr. Octavius Brine. Right. Apparently, Dave was, uh, Dave was originally the star of the Central Park Zoo, zoo with all his amazing tricks until the, penguins came, until the penguins came along with their incredible cuteness. He kept shipped from zoo to zoo, zoo and a penguin kind of shipped him off again until he was just left out. So he planned on getting revenge on all zoo penguins. Penguins by trying to use some sort of serum by turning them in all into monsters. Well, they steal some serum and also uh, they have snow oil collection and they run off and run off throughout the streets of Venice where they end up getting abducted. Eventually they are saved by this group called the North Wind, a group of uh, Arctic creatures who are pretty much the same style as uh, the penguins, except they have more high-tech gadgets. They include Classified the Wolf, Pure Boost the Harp Seal, Corporal the Polar Bear, and, e and Eva the Snowy Owl, who Kowalski gets a, has a crush on. <laughs> anyway, throughout the movie, Ubi Private actually seems that he has a known to his society as he's considered more of the uh, cute young young agent, unlike the others. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I'll tell you later on, he actually... And he realized it's his destiny. <laughs> but that's all I can tell you. Bunch of crazy stuff happens, including one of my favorite parts when Skipper calls again Rico. Rico do a bunny germ bermit honey slap polka where Rico and Clumpy slap each other's butts while <laughs> Skipper plays the accordion. <laughs> tell you, that is hilarious. I gotta admit, this is a, just an equally great spin off as Puss in Boots was. This was a good movie. Movie. If you guys know that the uh, Penguins of Madagascar are their own TV show, I'm telling you. If you like the TV show and you like the Madagascar movies, you're going to love the Penguins of Madagascar movie. It is amazing. Amazing. I give it a definite five tokens out of five. You guys will love it. So anyway, that concludes our edition of Flix Files. So stay tuned for more on WSN. And for more stuff on the way. Until then, see you soon.